गुड मॉर्निंग स्टूडेंट ना लास्ट टाइम आई कंप्लीट चैप्टर नंबर 11 वर्क एंड एनर्जी एंड टुडे आई एक्सप्लेन सम क्वेश्चन आंसर्स गिवन इन योर एक्सरसाइज क्वेश्चन आंसर्स ऑन पेज नंबर 158 क्वेश्चन नंबर 1 लुक एट दिस एक्टिविटीज एंड अंडरस्टैंडिंग अबाउट द टर्म वर्क फर्स्ट सुमो इज स्विमिंग इन अ पॉन्ड सो वी नो दैट सुमो स्विमिंग इन द पूल इज push the water in backward direction and displacement is in forward direction you know that when we can swimming it means work is done this is number 1 so first work is done second number a donkey is carrying a load on the back right means work done is zero no displacement will be take place third number a wind will lift the water from a well means Right, work is done. Displacement, change in the position. And fourth number, a green plant is carrying photosynthesis. No work is done, right? Because plant do not change its position. No displacement. Then an engine is pulling a train, right? Engine is pulling train means work done. Engine pull the train means displacement will be change take place. And Food grains are getting dried in the sun. No change in the plants and grains. Just they will be take the food grains. Means work is not done. And at last, the sailboat is moving due to the wind. When the wind blow, right? Work is done because sailboat is change its position. Displacement. When displacement is take place, at that time only we can say that the work is done. Okay, so here in this all you write the just write the question and against it write you do that work done right work done work is not done. Now question number two, an object to a certain angle on the grounds. What is the work done by the force of gravity on the object? We know that when as there is no displacement in the direction. of the force means work done is zero because there is no change in the position initial and final positions are at the same line on the same line means no change is on the same line initial and final so work done is zero okay now question number 3 third question see is this question You write the answers in your classwork. Which questions I will here explain you today? Question number three. Question number three. A battery light bulb describes the energy change in the process. You know that. When battery, battery means which type of energy? Battery is contain chemical energy, and when it's light up, means heat energy or light so battery you write chemical energy of battery right means chemical energy of battery transfer right and transfer into light up means which energy right into heat energy so battery is contain chemicals so chemical energy right of battery transfer into heat energy of bulb filament right and then you write Heat, heat produce, correct? Which is further transfer and and further transform into right light energy. Okay, so in this question, 
when the battery battery it contains the chemical energy of battery transferred into heat energy of bulb filament bulb contains the filament and further it transferred into light energy means it is light up so when bulb is light up chemical energy transfer into heat energy and heat energy will further transfer into light energy so today you start the question answers of exercise given in your textbook page number 158 you write those only three questions other questions i will send you pdf otherwise no need to write further question answer till up to here you will write and finish this lesson work and energy okay thank you